What is up guys, it's your boy and the arts and today we are going to be drawing I guess One Piece favorite anime girl which is Nami Nami Swan Time Skip Nami uh, or the Big Booby Nami <laughs> The popular one Not the one from the first season, but the popular one after 500 episodes After 500 episodes of One Piece Yeah that Nami. <laughs> so, um, you know, uh, there's a certain way to draw One Piece girls. And I, I, I've been studying how to draw One Piece girls. And there's a certain way, there's a certain type of shape that you have to follow. And I think I get it right. I think I get it right. So we're going to start out with the head here. We're going to start out with the head. And, um... Oh, I think I did, I did her ears way too big. I think I did her ears way too big. But Nami. Nami's one. Um, yeah, so Nami, uh, I think in the anime, she's supposed to be like Swedish. I think she's Swedish according to the character profile, right? She is tall, or at least she appears to be tall, very slim. Big boobas, because of course we have to mention that. <laughs> we have to mention that um, because I mean they're kind of like right in front of your face. So what the heck? Big boobas. Um, and right now, right here, what I'm doing is I'm just shaping out the rib cage, and um, I'm gonna show you guys in a moment what I mean by the one piece girl body type. I'm gonna shrink this up just to fit it in the canvas, right? So we did the rib cage, and now we are just going down and finishing up the torso. And uh, all right, so here we got the pelvic area, and I'm trying to draw her skinny, very slim, very slim. So One Piece girls, I noticed that they they're, they have like this very long hourglass figure, where like in the midsection, like in the tummy area, the waist. They're like, they have like no guts. <laughs> There's like no guts. Like the organs are just basically like squished. Just squished in. <laughs> like they were wearing a corset. I mean, they're very, very curvy. Very curvy, you know, without being... I guess you could say they're curvy without being thick. Just really hot. They're, they're just, just, she's just a hot chick, you know? And... Um, Yeah, so uh, I messed up on her arms a couple of times, so I had to like redo it. So yeah, her arm. I'm just trying to make it like slimmer, I guess, because she's you know she's a slim girl. Um, yeah, so I'm trying to get that that shape. I think I think I met her. I, I, she should she should have been a little bit skinnier, I guess here. But anyways, that's fine. I think since we're drawing her from the side, you know we're. we're She's, there, she's going to show a little bit more volume. But in the anime, man, they, they do make the, the characters just like these, these Victoria's Secret, you know, barely eating type of girls. <laughs> I mean, they're skinny. They're, sk they're skinny, but they look hot. Yeah, they look hot. They, they, they always look good. And of course, Oda, Ichiro Oda always draws them big with big boobaloos. Um, usually all of them. Yang Nami, Nico, what's the other girl? That was like another one, I forgot the name. They're, they all have, they, I mean, I mean, that's part of the anime fan service, I guess, right? And uh, drawing the eyes is pretty simple. You know, the One Piece eyes are pretty simple. They're basically, they're almost like, I guess, like American style, just like these almond shape, right? These like teardrop, well, not teardrop, I don't know if it's teardrop, well, almost like an almond shape type of eyes. All right, and I'm just uh, finishing up the hair here. She's a redhead. Nami is a redhead. Are there redheads in Sweden? In Sweden, I think there are. I think there's redheads in Sweden. I'm not sure. Yeah, I mean, there's blondes. Lots of blondes in Sweden. There's got to be some redheads. It's Europe. It's Europe. There's got to be redheads up in Europe. Who am I kidding? 
Yeah, so I think I got the figure pretty good here, and now I'm just trying to make her look like the character. Um, in the time skip, she lets her hair grow. Nami usually has like shorter hair, like up to her neck, but in the time skip, I mean, she really let her hair go, yo. Uh, I mean, I, I think in general, girls look better with long hair. Long hair always looks better. And if you're a guy, I guess unless you're like a metalhead, <laughs> unless you're like a metalhead, doesn't really look that great. Well, no, actually, no. If you're a metalhead, then yeah, long hair does look great. Long hair is, is metal. Metalheads have long hair. You guys get the point. All right, so now um, just shaping out the, the bras. Uh, and <laughs> I like the fact that throughout the, uh, I guess, this part of the anime, she's just wearing a bra, a bra and a pair of jeans. That's literally all she's wearing. Now, bro, in a pair of jeans. Anyways, so this is how you draw Nami, dude. Um, you know, once you draw One Piece girls, uh, once you draw one One Piece girl, I, I you know, I kind of feel like you get the hang of the body shape of the, the females in in, the, in One Piece. And then you can pretty much draw them all. I was thinking of drawing Nico or Robin. Uh, maybe I'll do it in some video, but as of right now, we're just focusing on Nami. All right, so I'm going to go into a time lapse to the point where I finish this, um, you know, where I finish, in, you know, drawing it and inking it. Then we're going to move on to coloring. So here we go. All right, dudes, here we go. So um, I went ahead and added the uh, the flat colors, and I also painted the shadows, and on the skin I did the, uh, I guess, what is called the Terminator, which is like a, sh uh, a color between the the uh, flat color and the the shadow, right? So it's, it's this Terminator, and it's created by the sunlight. So it's created this, like, orangey, almost reddish color. Uh, I actually like the way it looks, man. It really looks really cool, just like that. Looks like a gradient that like the saturation from the sun looks really cool. But what do you guys think? Comment below. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and finish our Nami here. Uh, I'm gonna jump into another time lapse so that we can go ahead and finish her up. Here we go. What is up guys it's your boy okay so I'm back and it looks like we are basically done with done with the uh, the art piece yeah so Nami uh, I really enjoyed really enjoyed drawing her it was really fun and uh, I mean it's our pirate girl <laughs> it's our pirate girl for God's sakes it was fun drawing her and uh, I think it came out pretty good it came out pretty good and what I'm doing here I'm just adding these highlights just these these last touches right um, these last touches here, just the hair highlights, and uh, you know, because the idea behind this drawing is that she's a pirate, so she's always out in the sun, getting sunlight. And I'm gonna go ahead and change the uh, <clears throat> the layer the layer color mode to uh, glow to add glow, and it creates these like highlights, these. And I chose this color because, uh, again, she's she has she's a redhead. So like when the sun hits hits the uh, when the sun hits you, creates this this color that is, um, I guess, along the lines in the color wheel of like of orange, which is which which would be yellow, right? A much lighter uh, a tone, or should I say, much brighter tone um, in in this family of colors. I like how it looks. Looks great. Um, looks good. Yeah, this is one of my favorite things to do when coloring is just the hair highlights. Creating these hair highlights, you know, these bright colors these on the yellow. Very fun, very cool. And uh, I'm just finishing up here. Alrighty. <clears throat> Okay, that looks... Oh, and, and in case you guys didn't know, the sunlight is actually coming from the top right. Yeah, see the little red red circle up there? That's the sun. So here it is. Here is the entire picture. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, <laughs> the drawing show. And that's going to be pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell for future notifications. It's your boy, Andy Art. And I'll see you in the next art video. Peace.